everybody, my name is Rebecca Grace and I'm a Squarespace expert and website designer. Today we're going to be talking about how to animate text on your Squarespace website. So the first thing that you want to do is add the text you're going to animate. So for instance, if I want to animate the words here, our story, I'm going to click to edit. And then where I want the text to be, I'm going to click and add a code block. And then in the code block, you're gonna copy and paste the code listed below this video. In this case, I want my code to be centered, so I'm going to use the centered text, like this. Um, the difference being that it has this style tag that says text align center. If you want it right aligned, you can change the word center to right as well. And then I'm going to change the words insert text here to our story. Okay. I also want it to be a heading rather than a paragraph. So instead of P's, I'm going to change this to an H1. You could also change these to H2, H3, H4, and so on. Okay, and then I'm going to click Apply. And then I can delete the text block that I had here and click Save. Let's say I also want another block down here to um, animate. Maybe I want this Best Friends to animate as well. Again, I'm going to click Edit. Repeat the process that I did before. So I'm going to click and add a code block. Paste the code in, and I'm going to change this to best friends. I'm going to change these to heading ones. Now for SEO purposes, you really shouldn't have more than one heading one per page. Um, but just to stick with the consistency, I'm going to use a heading one. Then I'm going to delete the text here. And there we go. Okay, the next step is to choose the animation that I want to use. So, so I've linked Justin's um, animation cheat sheet. Uh, so you're welcome to use this animation or other animations that you know of. And he's got a whole bunch of different animations here that you can choose from. So all you do is click on them and it will show you what it looks like here. So I think for this one I want it to slide in from the right, for instance. So I'm going to use the code slide right um, with no space and a capital R. That is the code that I'm going to use. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on download. Click download and it will open up this style sheet and I want to find the code that says slide right. You can see it right here. So what I'm going to do is copy from dot slide right down to this last bracket here. I'm going to copy it. I'm going to go to design, custom CSS, and paste the code in there. And then I also have to add at the very top this little bit of code. And this will hide the text until the animation appears. Right now you should just see your blocks disappear. Okay, because we haven't actually added um, the code for the animation to apply. So you should just see your text blocks disappear. The last thing we need to do is add some JavaScript so that these animations apply at the right time. So you're going to go to settings. Right here. Advanced. Code injection and copy and paste the code listed below this video in the header. Now, if you already have a line like this in your code, a jQuery library added in, you can skip this step. You only want one of these lines, libraries, added into your, your site. And then copy and paste this code into the footer. And then you do also need to change name of animation to the animation that you chose. Make sure you do it exactly as it is presented in the CSS code. So in this case, mine is slide right. So I'm going to do slide right. And it had a no space or dash and a capital R. Click save. And you should see that as you scroll, they're going to slide in to the right. Now you'll notice because I have an animation at the top of my screen, I actually had to scroll a little bit first before it went and that's not necessarily ideal. So if that's you and you have an animation at the top of your screen that you want to run before having to scroll, but then you also have text down the screen that you need to wait until it scrolls, 
you're going to go to code injection and then use the following code instead where it has it run on document ready as well as window scroll and again you need to change name of animation to the animation that you chose Hit save And then as I reload the screen, you should see this first one have the animation come in. And then as I scroll, the next one comes in. And that is how you animate text on your Squarespace website.